What's up, guys? This is Agricon 96 here, bringing you this year's first review of NECA's Bioshock Infinite Motorized Patriot, featuring the George Washington likeness. Now, this is a pretty much a deluxe figure, which is priced around thirty dollars, more or less, and he's really big on camera. He may look a little small right now, but once I bring in a size comparison, you'll see what what he's really worth. So, what we have here is uh, the figure with an accessory. Um, crank gun and two flags and a head here. So let's just take a look at the detail here. Um, really great. You can see that the texture the gun is, is great. The hands the joints really awesome. The flags are huge as you can see. Um, now he's a bit hard to move around and I'll, I'll tell you guys a, a flaw that happened with mine in a bit. So I have to be gentle because mine actually broke when I took it out of the package. And I, it's sad to say but I have to be honest with you guys because it is a review. But um, let's, uh, let's take out the gun here. So you basically know what he looks like with his gun. Um, it's really... Uh, really close here and, and tight and because the joints are so tight it you don't want to risk breaking the figure here as you see I'm, I'm having a look it just literally broke on me see this really sucks and I really wish it didn't have to do this look the the handle just snapped off the gun and it's super unfortunate um, obviously wasn't planning on this to happen but that really sucks. Anyway, here he is. I'm gonna have to fix that later. Um, better look at the details here. And for the articulation, the arms go out in forward back. Uh, rotate at the wrists no upper articulation here arms go I mean legs go forward back out in bend at the knee and ball jointed ankles here you have a ball jointed neck and that's about it um, you don't really want to move him around too much either he's pretty top heavy but let's take a look at the, uh, the side here really nice Take a look at the back. Let's take the flag off. Nice detail here. String here. Really cool metallics going on here. Let's take a closer look at the head. So really cool with the creepy eye. But man, am I bummed out. This thing just broke on me in the middle of a review really sucks the cool thing about the accessory here is that um, when the crank was attached here when you crank the the, the, the lever it actually turned you know um, but geez I mean it, it broke on me that really sucks I really hope it's just my figure because if this happens to a lot of other guys it's really unfortunate um, Everything was made super well, but it seems like the handles of the gun are really hard to handle because this handle broke off as well, but that wasn't a crank. This one is actually a mechanism, so it really sucks that this just happened, um, and I'm sorry about that, guys. Way to start off a review of the year, but here is uh, the flag. Um, really cool. We got the nice burns and the, and the rip. A uh, really big flag here. Really nice. I seem to be running low on my camera battery once again. Um, so let's do a quick size comparison. Let's bring in other Bioshock figures. Alright, so first we're going to bring in 
Elizabeth. So look how small she is against this guy. Um, let's check out the Boys of Silence who were big, really big compared to the other ones. He is still smaller. And why not even bring in a big daddy? Now look at that, huh? So as you can see, this George Washington towers over these guys. And uh, I forget he has the, the other head here. The jaw isn't articulated. It's uh, sculpted that way. But yeah, can't stress enough. This is a huge bummer that the the handle just broke off on me. I'm gonna have to do some nice crazy gluing. But this is a great figure. Um, even despite the gun flaws, I still recommend it. He's huge. Hopefully, it's just what my figure doesn't happen to you. Um, because it's a great figure to have. It's, uh, obviously, if you're a Bioshock fan, Bioshock Infinite. Um, yeah, it's uh, unfortunate. But anyway, keep checking out my channel. Um, soon there's going to be a Booker DeWitt action figure coming by NECA. And that should be really exciting. And um, I don't know what else is coming in the next series. But I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Sorry about the gun breaking on me. Really sucks. Um, but yeah, until next time, you guys take care. And make sure your gun doesn't break. Be very careful. See you guys later. Alright, don't go yet. I fixed the gun. I want to show you the crank mm -hmm. method here. Um, watch the gun. Look at that. How awesome is that? So you just crank the gun and it actually turns. Um, and yeah, there you go. That's uh, how it works here. But um, it's just a little puzzle piece. I'm going to have to crazy glue it back in. Um, but yeah, here it is. Um, so yeah, sorry. So this is the official goodbye. So I'll see you guys later, and take care.